Okay, I was recently watching a video by Ostor960 and he was reviewing his Greg Letzka frog skins. I don't have the frog skins. Um, when the frog skins were coming out, they started coming out with collector's editions and limiteds of everything under the sun. So I kind of burnt out of those pretty fast. Uh, I did get a couple really cool ones early on, which I'm really happy with. But then when they started coming out with, you know, uh, special editions for meat shops, uh, I, I kind of lost interest after that. So. What I have here is the Greg Letzka Fedora. Uh, if you take a look here, we got the tag on the back, which just basically says uh, Greg Letzka. It says Good Living Line from Oakley. I kept the tags on it because, I don't know, I thought they were kind of cool. I don't really wear this out in public, so I didn't really mind just keeping all the tags on it and such. So here's the Oakley tag. This is, uh, yep, it's 23 bucks. Not too bad. Size so I didn't know hats had sizes. I mean, I guess they do because people have different size heads. But you know, if someone asked me, "Well, what size hat do you wear?" I'd be like, "I don't know." Uh, it's a seven and a half, which seems to fit fairly well. It's not really too bad. Now, the thing I like about this is, uh, you know, it kind of looks possibly like it could be cheap construction, like it's just some sort of weave pattern that's been cut. But on the inside, uh, I believe this is a new era fit. Let's see. Yeah, it's a new era. Inside, they've done a lot of detailing. So we have. The classic retro logo there in purple stitched. Uh, I guess it's just a medium. I guess seven and a half is a medium. Uh, we've got the new era logo. Uh, the whole inside is lined with the Oakley print, which is pretty cool. Again, we have the Greg Letzka, if I'm pronouncing that right, I'm not sure, uh, good living line with his emblem. Some cool stuff there. And the nice thing is it's actually padded here. They've put in some lining in beneath this. So when you put it on, it actually fits nice and snug without really having a rough pattern pushing against your head. So as far as comfort goes, this fits probably better than some of the baseball caps I've had. Um, it's a really nice pair. It's super comfortable. Uh, I don't know what I'd wear it for because it's kind of a little too formal for, you know, just casual use. It's really not that formal for anything that would be have to be formal. But I don't know. I mean, I just like it. I like collecting things that are out of the ordinary, something that's cool, something that most people don't have. And this one's really, you know, really kind of fits the bill. So I just wanted to do that as sort of as a video response to uh, Ostor's review. And I hope you enjoyed that. Thank you. Bye. Oh.